for sure. Jordan Spieth, second shot here at one. We tugged it off the tee. We do see that the rough is a lot drier this year than years past. Jordan Spieth at the first from the bunker. This should be pretty routine here, Kevin. Straight back up the hill. Uh -huh. That's exactly what we expected. And a little bit of mixed results over the past few year, years here. Consistent results, though. Seven top 20s. Yes, he had, he's had a, a little bit of the handlebars on it. Not a driver. That explains it. This is a good one. Trying to use that opening. You know how you knew it was good, Frank? He didn't hear him talking to him. <laughs> good strategy, though, right? Does not hit driver off the tee. It's pretty high up in strokes gain putting. Would have been the third eagle of the day at the seventh. Easy tap in for birdie here at the seventh. First of the day for Jordan Spieth. This is pretty routine right here. Slight upslope. Work left. Right. Good save. He's, it looks like he's just going to take the corners of all these dog legs. Uh, yeah. he picking up the tee quick. I think he likes it. Off the right is the wind, so that should hold up in the fairway. Yeah, it just does. A little, probably a little further back than he would have liked, but playing from the fairway, that was the goal. 173 to cover that bunker right on line with the flag. Good thing the flag's in the back downwind. Got to turn over, and that is not what he wanted to do there. <laughs> During the playing through, another look, Jordan Spieth from the bunker. He actually hit out of turn there. Hatton was away, but Jordan was ready to go. He decided, I'm going. Downhill lie, downhill to the hole. <laughs> it does get to the point of the ridiculous with him, doesn't it? And he just. Oh, not too much. Oh, this should be fine. I don't think he just liked the contact. It was like a little toe tumbler, maybe. Definitely a toe tumbler, and it is going to work. Really well. Fairways are firm. Took advantage of the firm fairways with that one. Turn over a little bit. Oh, he got away with it. Just missed that bunker down there. So in great shape now. Good line. What a good try. All three players in that group make birdie like they should at the 11th after good tee shots. That's a great shot. That is incredible. You gotta land that right on the front edge to have any chance. It is absolutely perfect out here. Spieth on the way at 13. And looks to be playing out to the right. No choice right there, Aaron. Yeah, no, just playing safe. I mean, you, you couldn't take the chance of dumping it in that bunker or running it through the green. Really firm conditions. These guys are dealing with some wind out there today. Did he hit it? Sure did. <laughs> Looked like a four the whole way. 
Find me a better score in the last 10 years in the PGA Tour. You can't find it. Maybe the last 20 years, including Tiger. Just he'll keep grinding. That's for sure. Uh, this one's over carved from left to right. I think he's going to be fine. Yep. Yeah, he had that ball teed down pretty good. I think that is exactly the shot he was trying to play, trying to hit the fairway finding cut, and he did. Boy, trying to get this one way up in the air. Sit. 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 Asking for it to get down. Good shot right at it. Don't want to go long there. Aim more left than that. Did he get it right? He sure did. What a birdie. Third toughest hole in the golf course. And only the fourth birdie of the day there. Trouble down the left, some bunkers on the right. You'd like to hug that right side of that fairway as it cants right to left. This is right though, Frank. It's going to miss the bunkers. Oh, the tree as well. Tree. Oh, he did not. He did, did not get good contact. That hit the lip, and now he's right next to Rory's ball, which just rolled out of the bunker in an identical spot. Wow. Short's better than long. He's going to play for the flyer if he gets it. This one came out somewhat normal, Frank. Might have to go a bit. Uphill line, ball above his feet, wind into him. Oh, gorgeous. Nearly did it again. And then there's one at the top, Matt Wallace. Got a moment. Send it down to Todd Lewis. All right. Thank you. Here with Jordan Smith after that 69. Four birdies on his card. Most of those birdies coming on the more difficult back nine. He did bogey the 18th. I know you didn't want to have that bogey, but it was a nice one. Still, you leave this golf course with the attitude of what regarding your play today? Yeah, it was great. I, it was pretty windy starting out today, and I thought, and this this course could be, you know, uh, U.S. Open uh, feel to it. And uh, the wind died down a little bit as we started onto the back nine. And, um, you know, I hold a bunker shot. It was kind of, you made a long putt. It was one of those days where I probably played, you know, a couple, I kind of got a couple out of the round, which is really nice because we get plenty of, plenty of rounds where we feel like we should have shot a couple shots lower. It, you know, we've talked about your wrist uh, being bothersome starting with the PGA Championship, but you played through that, you played last week. How would you describe the health of your body and your game right now? Yeah, I feel good. Um, I wouldn't be playing if it was any bit of an issue at all. I just, I tape it up to not not have the one random one that could mm. really damage it. So, um, yeah, I feel I feel solid. I just took enough time off that um, I, I I would say I was a little rusty on and around the greens. And I spent a lot of time putting and chipping this week, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. And it, it served me well today for sure. And hopefully I can keep that going. Yeah, your short game was excellent. One last thing in regards to the golf course. Um, it did yield some low numbers today, but rain is not in the forecast. Yeah. What are you expecting from your village come the weekend? I expect tomorrow morning to feel a bit like today, possibly a little more scorable. And then after that, you know, it could be mayhem. Um, it's one of those tournaments that has a tendency to guys shoot up and then back back, back um, towards closer to par on the weekend. So um, it's just put the ball on the putting surface and two, take your medicine where you need to, don't make worse than bogey and um, try and take advantage of the par fives. Thanks for watching the PGA Tour on YouTube. To watch more, click here. To subscribe, click here.